Today I'm going to show you how to commission and set up your EG4 Wi-Fi dongle with your EG4 Monitor Center account. Now, in order to create an account, you will need a dongle serial number and PIN. To start, plug in the dongle that comes with your inverter into the dongle port on the side and make note of the serial number and PIN for that dongle. If the inverter is online, you should see a green blinking light where the Wi-Fi symbol is. If you purchased a cell dongle to use with your system instead, you can skip the Wi-Fi commissioning steps and go straight to adding it to your account. You may notice that the connection process could take up to five minutes. Once you have your dongle plugged into your inverter, you will need to download the EG4 monitor app on your mobile phone in order to commission the dongle. If you already have an account, it may auto log you in you will need to be logged out of your account in order to commission another dongle. Once you're on the front screen, you'll need to connect to the Wi-Fi signal that the dongle is emitting. So go to your phone's Wi-Fi settings, and make sure your Wi-Fi is enabled, and then try to connect to the serial number on your dongle. This should be B, letter, and then a string of numbers. You may also want to turn off your mobile data during this time so it doesn't confuse your phone and try to connect with your mobile data. Once you've successfully connected to the dongle, your phone should say something like connected without internet. Then you can go to dongle connect and from a drop down that will appear, it may take a little bit of time, select the Wi-Fi that you want to connect to and type the password into the password bar. Now make sure that your password is absolutely correct because when you press home Wi-Fi connect, it will send that password to your dongle without saying whether or not it's the correct password because your phone doesn't do the checking. If you did put in the correct password, your Wi-Fi light should go solid green and the rest of your lights should eventually turn on as it connects to the cloud. If you're using the BJ series of dongles, you can also set them with Bluetooth if you have an Android phone. Make sure that the Bluetooth on your phone is on and press set with Bluetooth and search for your serial number from the list that it provides. Then simply click on the Wi-Fi you wanna use input your password and press home Wi-Fi connect. Now that our dongle is set up, we can either register for an account if we don't already have one or go ahead and log into the account to add it to a current station. From the main screen, we'll want to go to the configuration tab and then under the dongles section, you can press add dongle. And from here, all you need to do is plug in the dongle serial number, plug in the dongle pin, and then select the station that you have that you want to connect it to. If your inverter is online and your dongle is set up properly, you should see a connected under the connection status. Your inverter serial number should now appear in the drop down list, allowing your system to now be monitored. Thank you for watching. Leave a comment down below if you have any feedback or questions, and make sure to like and subscribe to be notified of future content. We'll see you next time.